Hey, welcome to Garden Chronicles. Welcome to my channel. As I promised, I want to showcase to you my black velvet begonia, where you can actually see the the brilliant blue iridescent, which I want to show to you during this night time. I was quite uh, flabbergasted and mesmerized by the blue tones that I actually see here, and it really gave me the kind of a cool feeling within my within me. Okay, uh, there's nothing much that I want to say. I just want you to enjoy the show and uh, just want to, uh, what do you call this, uh, uh, showcase all the colors and uh, more of uh, discovering all the tones of different begonias that actually have this sheen, this black velvet sheen. So, uh, hope you enjoy the show and uh, here it goes. This particular leaf uh, is actually spent and so is it so I, I don't really see the blue sheen compared to the other and look at that that one really uh, mesmerized me too I was surprised that even the small tiny spots actually makes a difference this is another one it's a bit hidden I find it very difficult to take it out of the other leaf because it's actually disturbing but uh, Nevertheless, it, it actually has that. It's quite elusive actually. I can't really get the right angle to to show the shine. Nevertheless, uh, it's there. I, I just wish I had more of the undamaged leaves. Uh, and it will be truly remarkable to see a full bloom of all this blue. Uh, also this is quite elusive uh, i thought this will shine because most of my leaves are quite big and showy but uh, it's it's not really there silvery gives a blue but amazingly the blue is very much more of a purple and and it's it's quite uh, quite a discovery, quite a surprise. I've actually switched off the light to see the difference, and uh, I notice it's only available with the lighting. I'm still wondering what is the purpose of this begonias having this uh, blue sheen because they don't actually glow in the night so the colorization may actually somehow create a protective uh, uh, element from creatures not to damage their leaf especially the nocturnal animals or perhaps they, it, it may be totally for for the photosynthesis the purpose of it for the leaf to absorb more more light during the daytime and the night i will never know all this seems to be very mysterious and intriguing to me uh, this is actually separate from there i i was drawn aback with the serangelina which uh, also have the shine with it but it's not so visible on the camera it, it does have the glimmer but it doesn't have the blue sheen so so there's a, a lot more to look at it on, on that basis but I find that uh, the Bethlehem star and the black velvet begonia seems to have more brighter and brilliant blue compared to this particular one. And I was surprised to notice that this particular one, Silver King, seems to have that brilliant blue. And I was actually amazed at that and quite shocked to see that it, it, it actually, that this particular leaf is actually blocking the light. So I have to move aside a bit. You look at it, it's just you'll be see you'll you'll know what I mean. 
Look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? It's much more brilliant. It's so like cerulean blue. I think only the new leaf seems to have more of that effect compared to compared to others. Even the silver limbo don't seems to have that effect. Uh, there you can see a little bit of that at the wings, but uh, that's all there is actually. I know you must be thinking that I've gone <laughs> madly in love with begonias and I'm, I'm just stuck with this, so please bear with me. Anyway, I, I'm already done with this one to make a 5 minute video on this. Thank you so much for visiting and enjoying my discovery and adventure with this begonia. I hope you enjoyed the show. Do click like and subscribe and if any have any questions or comments, I would really love to hear from you. Thank you and have a nice, good, good day, good night, whichever time, time that you are in. Have a nice day. Bye.